Thank God that the brothers on the rise now. And the celebrations all in my house. Hello everybody, welcome back to Top Bins Football. I'm Ben and I'm here with Aaron, Cal and Louie. And you've seen what we'd do if we were Jurgen Klopp. So today you're going to see what our 11s would be if we were Gareth Southgate. Yes. Our starting 11s. Um, Who wants to go what, we're going to do, what we're going to do is we're all going to do it individually and then we're all going to decide if that was a bad team, good team, what you would do differently. So I think... As our resident shit house, um, Aaron, go first. <laughs> yeah, all right. I mean, yeah, fine. <clears throat> no worries. No worries. Uh, right. So in goal, I had Nick Pope. At right back, I had Tavernier. Uh, centre backs: uh, Connor Cody and John Stones. Left back is Luke Shaw. Now, uh, right mid, uh, so I've gone for a full one, full one, sorry, I should have said that to begin with. Right mid, I've gone for uh, Saka from Arsenal. And then centre mids of Phil Foden and James Madison. Left mid, I've gone Grealish. And up top, I have big old Kane. That's my 11. Yeah. Like oh, sorry, that. sorry. I, I forgot I forgot Hendo at CDM. Sorry, I, I do apologise. Yeah, Please right, skip right, past it. Right. Sorry, yeah. Can so, you run for your midfield again? Yeah, so CDM Hendo, and then the midfield is Saka out on the right, um, Phil Foden, James Madison, and Grealish. Grealish is playing well, on the left wing. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. Dropping, left, left wing, left wing. So you're dropping Sterling? Uh, yes. Uh, as to, as my starting eleven, yes, I think Grealish will start. Yeah, that is mad. That's mad. I agree with Aaron. Of course, Grealish you do. So. No, well, no, but Grealish. So you're going to put Grealish Sterling, in a position Sterling he doesn't in play, uh, to then replace him, to replace Sterling. So you, you play Grealish in a cam role, and then I'm, I'm not even going to get onto Hendo. Hendo making that team is a fucking travesty. Uh, well, yeah, uh, that's your opinion, I guess. And I, 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 I understand. It. I understand why. I understand why because then it's a spine of leaders all the way. Yeah, down. yeah. Like, yeah, that, that's so, the reason. Um, like his leadership, his like you know, his control, yeah. his experience. You know, that's that's why he's in there for me, Hendo. Um, but yeah, I, I thought you might have had a bit of a uh, an argument with me over Tavernier, but I, I thought I'd put it in based on uh, performance, especially this season. Like, just give him a go, give him a give him a chance. Yeah, I around. completely agree. I'm I'm behind that. To be fair. So yeah, that, that's my eleven. So what, what would you boys was... change apart from oh, Grealish shot on the left? Well, I think we should all go for our team because if yeah, I yeah. say I put him, if I put him in instead of him in, then yeah, people yeah. are going to just work yeah. out our teams. Yeah, no worries, no worries. So who wants to go so, next? Um, I'll go my team now. So yeah. I've got Nick Pope yeah. in goal, Shaw yeah. left back. Oh, sorry, my uh, four one three yeah. two, my my setup. Right, Shaw yeah. left back, Maguire and Stones centre backs, Trent right back. Right, Declan Rice holding. Okay. Saka on the right, right, Foden through the middle, Sterling on the left, and Kane and Calvert Lewin up top. He's left out Grealish. Yeah, I have. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. The only but, thing I would say right. with that is Maguire England. Why is a question? Play. Yeah, and England don't play two up top. See, I was when. Who's up top? Who's up top? Kane and Calvert Lewin. Calvert Lewin. Oh, my lord. See, when I, w- I was originally had Cody and Stones in there, and then I remember Benny in the group chat last night saying about how good Maguire is for England. Not amazing, but better for England, and it reminded me. So yeah, yeah but I think Maguire if- performs better for England than he does for United. Yeah, yes. but you can't risk that. You can't just say, "Oh, he's and played he's shit all season." He's yeah, not a leader. He's played shit all season. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to risk it and say because before he's played well for England, so that means he must be must play well again. Boy, it's just yeah, my opinion, I you know. You yeah, no, no, that's right. yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. We're here to pick them apart if we yeah, yeah. disagree, but yeah, that's fine. Benny, do you want to go next? Yes. So I've got a four-two-three-one. I've got Pope in goal as well. Cash at right back. Stones and Maguire at centre back. Shaw left back. Dyer and Rice holding. And then up top, I've got Grealish, Foden, and Mount, and Kane as a striker. Um, the reason I've got those three, they're all interchangeable. They can all yeah. either play any formation, any position in that three. 
Um, the two wing backs are quite attacking. So either of the um, DMs can drop into defence. Yeah. And it's easy to play a three back or a five back if we're defending or attacking or you're yeah. essentially and playing thought... but like you're essentially playing a six four. That's it. Like, your two your two CDMs also play centre back for the country and their club. Like Eric Dye hasn't played CDM. Yeah, but they also season. play centre mid. Yeah. But like I, I agree with your top your front things, I think. I quite rate that team, Benny, to be fair. Yeah. Not the sure about Dyer. Yeah. Mason Mount getting in over like some of the likes of James Madison potentially. Like yeah. on current performance on a higher been. I'm I'm kind of I'm kind of on that. I'm I'm on Mount over Ma- uh, Maddo. I think. Okay, fair enough. Um, yeah, I think they both make the squad, but I can't. I I, I, I they're not in my team. I think Maddo's on good form at the minute, though. Yeah, compared but he's to the Mount. only one. Not saying the Mount's in bad form, but. Matt was in good form until Lampard left. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's hear let's your team then, Lou, and then we can sort of digest. So I got, um, I got Pope uh, in the sticks. Uh, so I played a four, four, three, two, one. Yeah, four, three, two, one. So it's Pope in the sticks. I've got uh, Cody and Stones, um, uh, centre backs. I've got Shaw, left back. Matty Cash right back um, right wing is Saka and Sterling out on the left uh, Grealish Foden and Ward Prowse in the middle with Kane up top Ward Prowse is shot like, yeah Ward Prowse is uh, yeah he is one that I definitely considered but he didn't make the starting 11 for as, me as, as a box to box for me because he's a leader as well that's why I think yeah yeah and, and, I think... and uh, set piece specialists like yeah. yeah. Incredible. I think we unanimously agreed that Pope makes it to start. It yeah. was let, let's be honest, it's between him, it was between him and Pixford, but I think he has to get in over Pickford to start. I think I don't think it's out of him and Pickford. Or Henderson. I don't think Hendo, yeah, Henderson. Hendo, but Hendo doesn't play enough, so no. it's yeah. clearly Pickford. Hendo it's, clearly, yeah, yeah. it's gotta be Pope. Yeah, clearly but uh Pope. Yeah. And we all agreed so, yeah, Shaw on left back as well. Yeah, You'll sure. On, on, yeah. on current form, like you know, there's no one else really. No. Who is the second choice? Target is a close second. Target or Chilwell? Yeah. Yeah. Chilwell, actually. Yeah. Shit. Target or no, Chilwell? But Shaw, yeah. Shaw's Shaw's in it over for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. So yeah, we had, we had a few yeah. different right backs yeah. cropping up there. So mine was Cash. What was yours? Mine was Tavernier. Mine was Cash. Mine was Trent. And Trent. So the one that was left out, probably Aaron. So Wan Bissaka. Yeah. But yeah. I think it's uh, and then there's Reese James who could also make the squad. If Wan uh, was better yeah, at attacking, yeah. I'd put him in because defending one on one and all yeah. that, he's amazing. But positioning and no, attacking, he's shit. It's position play. Yeah, there's that. Yeah, it's position play. Good enough. It's not good enough. I think Cash is a better defender, but he does flap a lot. But I, I'm, ha- yeah. I'm willing to take him. I'm willing to take him in the squad with a strong leader stood next to him, like Cody. Yeah. Um, and John Stone's next to him, kind of like controlling him. So I, I, I think that's why he's in that squad. Another unanimous decision but, uh, was uh, Stone's at centre-back. Yeah. What a season. 100%. Incredible form. What a season. Yeah. Um, and I, and I, I he has revitalised his career. Yeah, big, big man up front as well. Like, when he goes up to the corners, there's, he's he's the target. Like, I can, yeah. I, I, I'm definitely taking him, hundred yeah. percent. Yeah, yeah. I put Cody, and I think uh, you did as well. I, I put Cody. Yeah, yeah because I think I think he's got a little bit more about him than uh, Maguire. Like Maguire, we've seen him play for England before. You know, he's he was decent, but I think Cody's more of a leader than what. The only um, thing keeping Cody not in the squad. This is the only argument for me is that the club he plays for can see too many goals. Um, mm. Yeah, but 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 then That's what I thought. But then you put, but then so like you've just agreed that he's he concedes too many goals. Maguire plays for Manchester United, and Man United have the most conceded goals in the Premier League in the top ten. I think we're level with that's, Brighton. That's a, that's we're level with Brighton. I think. That's, yeah, yeah, yeah. So and they're they're eight, they're seventeen. Like it's like it's so Co- it's either Cody. Who else was there? Concert. Uh, well, yeah, concert having a season. 
Constance having a fucking season. Um, but, or Declan Rice could play that centre back role. Eric Dyer could play that centre back role. Gomez would be in the conversation um, if he wasn't injured, but obviously we can't we can't yeah. speak about him because he's injured. He yeah. hasn't played this year. If he played, yeah. he probably makes the squad. Which is a shame because he's he's so pacey, and that next to Stones yeah. would be perfect. You know for yeah, and the pace. Yeah, he, he makes my squad if he had a good season. Yeah, if he was fit. Ben Ming. Ben Ming. Tyrone Mings maybe. Tyrone Mings. But, Mings. Yeah. He's a bit too. He's he's a bit erratic. Hot headed. Erratic. Yeah. He yeah. 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 King. He's having a good season. Cool King. Yeah, King. Tarkovsky. Yeah. There's a lot of choices. But they can see too much. Michael Keane is probably the least conceded centre back that we've just mentioned. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, I think, I think um, the, the best in the league, like conceding wise at the moment, is City and Villa and Spurs. I think. So Villa. So, so it'd be it'd be it'd be concert. So we've already got we've already got Stones. Well. Yeah. But then, I don't know, so, Concert doesn't make no my English. squad. But, um, no, he doesn't make mine either at the moment. But like, he's um, still a possibility. He doesn't make the starting 11. He makes he makes the team that fly out, I reckon, but he doesn't make the starting Maybe. Team. Because uh, I take I would take Keane, I think, as yeah. his number two. Yeah. I've already... um, Lewis Dunk as well. a good season. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's, he's... But then they can see too they many goals. They can see a lot as well. There's a lot of potential, yeah. and there's a lot of uh, a lot of options we've got in like the sort of centre back position for England. I think this is the most stacked England I've ever been. Yeah, um, yeah, especially in that, especially anywhere in the middle, like centre back, centre back, centre mids, centre forwards. They're all stacked. Mm -hmm. Yeah, someone we haven't mentioned though that was a right back. Um, I've just forgotten his name. Oh, well done. Uh. Right back, plays for Atletico Madrid. Trippier. 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 Trippier is 31. Like, it's like, he, he's not really had a great season either. He's playing out there. That, that doesn't prove anything to me. Yeah. Yeah. I see, he had a I good... See yeah, point. He, and I, Kyle I Walker. He... We didn't mention Kyle Walker. But... Yeah. Kyle Walker's... Yeah. No, tried, yeah. tried and tested for That's England. Awesome. He's, he's, he's class. Yeah. That's very true. Very true. So the two most like capped right backs we have, none of us are taking them. Aren't, aren't even in the team. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. But the Euros are for young, hungry players trying to trying to win in yeah. something. And then if you don't win the Euros, these young boys are then in a year's time, normally two years time, but in a year's time they're ready for the World Cup. Yeah. So yeah. Like that's mm -hmm. why that's why you take people like Rhys James or Avena or Matty Cash, like because then they're ready. They're hungry. For, for they've got that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree. Yeah, I agree as well. Um, so we left back, we all said sure, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I think quite, uh, three out of four of us, or all the four of us, said Saka. Did we? No, I didn't. I did. So that's one. Yeah, three I out of four. I did. I it so, was. Yeah. I was. Who did you put in right mid? Well, Maybe? I put um the three of them that are kind of interchangeable. Didn't oh yeah. Yeah, 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 much, um, So. Um, but like, I think the only competition for Saka in that right mid position is probably Rashford or Sancho. But Sancho doesn't make my squad. I don't think he's defensive no. enough. He doesn't track back. He's, he's not, not done enough. For you. And yeah, Rashford, really plays, Rashford plays better on the left than Dortmund the right. Are looking too far. No, no, well, no, because the, the wingers can play interchangeable. They're like you can swap them around. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. like, um, but I think Saka has proven himself, and he's a youngster. And Rashford kind of is out of form. Like he's like, yeah. I, 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 he plays when he wants to play. He he doesn't turn up to these games. He's a bit too selfish. I think he's being playing out of position. He should be playing up front. If we were having a competition of who can be offside the most, Rashford would definitely. Rashford, make. Oh Rashford god, yeah, my number. One. Yeah, fucking hell, he's uh, at the top of the table there, mate. Yeah. Let's let's remind everyone of Benny's tweet on the top bins uh, Twitter saying he back in the day he wouldn't be able to buy a Yorkie. <laughs> Insinuating he's <laughs> just know the offside rule, <laughs> but yeah, uh, one of the main reasons Saka gets in the squad for me is he's so like versatile. He can play on the left, he can play on the right, he can play, you know, he can, he, he can play, play, play central. Right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like uh, he's uh, so interchangeable. I've got him in like in my squad that I've set up on the right, but you know he can go wherever it's needed. 
It's like no, we said earlier, he's hungry as well. I put Sterling in the squad because of that reason as well. So it's like they can swap sides. Yeah. They're both, they're both so quick. Um, Sterling's more of a strike, like a left wing, like a left forward. Yeah. Mm. He could fit in that left left mid role for me. Because that's mm-hmm. where he played before. He played there for Liverpool, played there for Man City at the beginning. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Obviously, I think I was the only one to put uh, Henderson in. I, I've stated my reason as to why he's a leader. You know, he's holding, yeah. he's got the experience, etc. Who did you have in that sort of CDM role if you had a CDM? I put Declan Rice. I had Dyer and Rice. So Rice would have been my pick, but it would have been too defensive. Um, I think I, I like Rice, and he, he he makes he gets on the plane. But for for some reason, I, I went with Ward Prowse. Yeah, Ward Prowse. So, the CDM. Um, the reason I went. But he's a box, box. The, reason uh, the reason I went Rice is um he he's not scared to do the dirty dirty work. Yeah. He'll get back, he'll do this. But then he can also play he can he can like spot a pass, he can he can, he's kinda of like a deep lying like kind of playmaker almost. I think I think that's where I, I think that's the reason I picked Ward Prowse, but he's a bit more attacking. Um yeah. Ward Prowse, uh, I think Ward Prowse deserves a look in as well. He's never really had it. Uh, in the England squad, um, and he's having the season of his life. Oh, I agree with but, you on Ward Prowse, to be honest. Yeah, Ward uh, Prowse definitely makes the play for me. Yeah, yeah, hundred uh, percent. There's no, and in most most of our squads, there's no um, free kick specialist, no set piece specialist in True. most of our teams. True. That's Aaron's one thing that like Tavernier, Tavernier brings free oh, kick. Tavernier, very yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's why. That's another reason I put him in the squad. He scores goals for fun. As well as uh, I'm not. I'm. I. I. He. He makes the play every every week, every day. Yeah. Uh, Tavernier, Tavernier. But um, we had a bit yeah, of um, this, this eleven goals in twenty five appearances. As a right back, is world class. Yeah, that's good. Mm-hmm. As a right back. Um. So left mid, we kind of we kind of had a bit of um. Uh, argument. So I've I've said Sterling. I think a few people have said Sterling. I mean, I said Cowell's Sterling. Sterling. Both of you left them out. See, nice. I couldn't find a formation um, that suited me when I was looking through because I, I did mine on FIFA. So I was looking, at, I was looking through formations. I'm gonna look at all positions. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so um, yeah, like Sterling, he, of course, he, he makes the plane, and he would have made the squad if I could find a formation that suited it, or if I could sort of jig it around. But yeah, I stuck Grealish out there. Grealish, ideally for me, would play more central, but I stuck him out on the left because he can also play out there. Um, and I, I think uh, he, ma- he makes a squad regardless. With your team, because the way you've like kind of pushed him out on the left, probably would have played Maddo out on that wing because he's quicker. But, mm. um, uh, but then it's interchangeable as well. So it's, a good, it's yeah. a good way to pick, pick your team that can play anywhere in that midfield. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's... Yeah. But yeah, I, I I don't disagree at all that Sterling Sterling makes the that at least he's makes the play. The if, if not he's the one sport. of the world's best boys, he's one of the world's best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Got... So people, we're talking about young people and um, like potentially making it. No one's mentioned Smith Rowe. He's in he's in my squad. He, he makes he's the play. Squad, he's, in, yeah. he's not in the starting. He makes the play. Hundred um, percent. Because he's played such a similar role to to Grealish. And Foden, two of the yeah. best players in the league. They are the yeah. two best English players in the league for me. It's like you, they can't be picked over them. Like nah, he's no just un, he's, he's just unlucky to be born at this time where he's born with he's plays in the position where it's the most stacked midfield England have ever had. They've got they've, so, but then we got Mount, Foden, Grealish. Um, we got everyone. Maddo, Maddo, all in front of him. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There's, there's like Barkley, Winks, um, uh, Maitland Winks Niles. Is, Winks ain't even in my conversation. No, no, no. no he's, he's left in the airport. I was just trying to think of people that have England caps, <laughs> like have been called up. Yeah, um, yeah. I think we're pretty, we're pretty um, we... unanimous on Foden. 100%. Foden, yeah, 100%. he's got, he's got to be in the team. Yeah. He's incredible. He's, he's pre- Player of the year for me, and he's only twenty. Yeah. I mean, we he's can't speak about him. Oh. He's twenty. We can't, we can't speak about him earlier in the week being a potential future Ballon d'Or winner, and then say we're not taking him with us. So yeah. you know, no, yeah. no chance. He's, he's, he's got to come. 
how he's he played against off. Liverpool, how how he's played oh, all season, it's just like incredible. Just go, oh, like. And he's like when they interview him, he's just happy to be there. He's yeah, like, oh, I'm just here to play football. Uh, yeah. Just here to play football. Just here to play football. I'm just here to play football. I'm just playing uh, where I'm told. Yeah, go, oh, <laughs> so you're playing in a false nine. wanted me to. You're play, playing in a false nine role. Oh, was I? I'm just here, just playing. Just playing football. <laughs> yeah, that chilled against <laughs> Liverpool. Pat, Pat wanted me in goal. I play in goal. Yeah. <laughs> uh, he's like reformed the way to play centre mid as well. That that um. That attacking role, like um, mm. he just brings it to life. Just brings it to life. Yeah, he's the most exciting like young him, prospect him at, at the minute. At the yeah, I feel like him and um, City at the moment they have also like they've changed the kind of midfield, like yeah. the interchangeness, the getting forward. The we'll play the, we'll play five in midfield, no just, striker, and it doesn't look it doesn't look out yeah. of place. No, no, no not yeah, yeah, I yeah. agree. So, I'm going to say this out now, out loud. Foden is the future of English football. Mm. Like yeah. Foden is yeah. the next big captain, the next big thing. He is. He will be the England captain one day. He will be running like everything. He is the biggest thing to come out of this country in a long time, and I do believe that. I back that all the way. I, I agree. I back. Yeah, hundred percent. Hundred percent. We're pretty okay. unanimous on Grealish as well. Someone left him out. I didn't have him. Are oh, you? You're an idiot, bro. No. I'm not going to lie. I kind of forgot about him when I made the team. He made team of the year. I kind of, I kind of forgot about him when I made the team. Just because he doesn't want to sign for United. No, no, I love Grealish. I think he's amazing. Apparently, apparently, he wanted to play for him as a little boy. Yeah, shut up. Apparently, if I if I had to replace anyone United in my team with Grealish, it would have been Saka for Grealish. I'd replace Saka with Grealish, so I'd have Grealish, Who's your Foden, midfield? Sterling. Your it would be Grealish, Foden, Sterling if I swapped it. So you're playing three in the middle, yeah. With Rice behind them. Or Ward Prowse. Now you mentioned. Oh yeah, that. but you're playing two strikers. Yeah. I would have dropped your striker. Yeah, you're playing two strikers. Yeah, England. I would, I would have dropped the striker. I would have dropped one of the strikers and then Grealish as the number ten. Yeah, that's not the England yeah. way. Like, I, Cavallo makes the play. He doesn't start. Yeah, but... yeah the English way is not for at the back either. Though the English way is five well, at the back. Southgate loves five. Yeah, yeah. But that's why players like. Well, Carl Walker makes the squad because he plays on a right side of the three centres. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, this is our, uh, this is how we would do it. And, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I can see why you take two, but honestly, it doesn't make sense. In, I, in, I'd in, say in. I'd prefer to stack the midfield and have one up top rather than have two up top and less in midfield. Yeah, that's with, fair. with the options, with the options we have. If you win the ball in the midfield, if you can create a game. Yeah, if you control the game from the midfield, you control what happens up top. I'm yeah. not gonna lie. My excuse is that I forgot. I forgot about Grealish when I made the team. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Brilliant. <laughs> there's so many. There's so many in that midfield now that it's hard to remember everyone. It was first to put them in if it was on Dublin. <laughs> <laughs> well, my home's under the hammer starting. I thought we were gonna go on video without mentioning. Nah, him. we can't. We're every video now. He's in every video. Um, obviously, I had James Madison. Did anyone else put him in, or was it just me? I did, no, and then no. I remembered Foden, and I replaced it with Foden. Okay, I think yeah, so you, I, I, uh, I think two so. best English players. Yeah, pretty I much. I quite enjoy Maddo. I, I, I enjoy, enjoy Maddo. Maddo play. I think he's a very good player. Yeah, I, I just don't think great. he fits in my setup. Yeah, because then he, if you put him in, you have to drop either Foden or Grealish or Saka, I guess. But like, he, then you're kind of playing him out of position. Um, it, he's not getting in over Foden. Not a yeah. chance. No, no way. I think after this discussion, Grealish. Uh, um, uh, but, but Grealish moves central, uh, have Sterling play, and then Maddo drops to the bench, I think, after this yeah. discussion we've had. I mean, but, that makes um, sense. but yeah, no, I, I still I still agree that um, that he's a very, very good player. He definitely makes I think he makes, my, he, he makes the plane. Yeah, me. 100%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, if he plays or not, it's different, but like he, he's definitely... Cause, but then, it, if you, he makes the plane, you then can't take Mount, or you've got to take them both, and one of them isn't going to play, and then Smith Rowe doesn't make the plane. Yeah, this, that midfield's way too stacked. Yeah, this, this is this is one of the exciting things. We have depth. We have a lot of mm. depth and a lot of potential. The best chance because of the amount of squads that we could build. Yeah, the amount of different ways we can play as well. You know, if if we we play one way in a game and it's not working, you know, just fucking mix it up. Send Saka yeah. out to the left. Send Saka into the mid. You know what I mean? You know, there's loads yeah. of different players that that, we'll drop, that drop one of your midfields and then put two up top. Because yeah, exactly. We've got, because we all agree Kane is making that list. We all yeah like, yeah yeah. 
He's not my style. How of could football, the World uh, Cup Golden Boot win and not take? Yeah, not, could yeah, not exactly, take? exactly. He's, yeah. but then, but then you could drop a midfielder and put a striker on because we've got such, we've got loads of strikers ready, but they're not going to make the squad because Kane's too good. Mm-hmm. Like, yes, we've got, like, got Kane, Calvert Lewin, Calvert Lewin, Calvert Lewin, Lewin. Uh, Watson, uh, Watkins, sorry, Watkins, yeah. yeah. Um, Callum Wilson. Callum Wilson's a Callum shout. Wilson. Get Vardy out of retirement. He's injured. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, Tammy oh. Abraham. Yeah. Oh, Tammy. Tammy, he's... Tammy, Tammy. That's Michael big... Antonio. Tammy does, yeah, Michael Antonio, but he's always injured. I wouldn't take him. It's, yeah. it's, un, it's, a, it's, it's, it's too unreliable. Uh, I don't think you can take Tammy because he only plays cup games. Yeah. So it's like. He he's not playing against the big squads. Yeah, he scores hat tricks in the FA Cup, but it's like so. I score hat trick against. Could have Bayern. Rashford up there. Um, yeah. Could remember I said could. I wouldn't, yeah. but you could. Yeah. yeah. Mason Greenwood. Mason Greenwood. Um, he doesn't make my plane at all. No. Nah, he's no. too in and out of form at the minute. End of last He's season, he really made my plane. Yeah. Nah, end of last season, he was incredible. I think, I think Greenwood, Greenwood has has one flash of greatness in fifty game seasons. Don't? Yeah, so, so that's not good enough. No, nah. um, I'm just mentioning the possibilities. <laughs> they're not possibilities. It's, it's impossible. <laughs> you know what I mean? The uh, what's the word? Choices. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah you know. Danny what I mean. Ings, Patrick Ings- Bamford. Oh, Bamford is my pick. Bamford would make the flame for me. Yeah. Yeah. Danny Danny Ings, sorry, I had to. I had. I had to move the conversation away from Greenwood. <laughs> Dan, I, think that, I think Danny Ings is. Um, Danny Ings is is just too one dimensional as a striker. He, he is good, but it's just like it doesn't work against everyone. As we've seen, it didn't work when he played for Liverpool, and it doesn't work against big teams or even middle cut. Mid, it, no, it does work against big teams. It doesn't work against like middle of the road teams because they're too too physical for him. Um, I, I just don't think he makes my squad because of that. But whereas Bamford is in the form of his life, yeah. But Watkins also make is is in a good form and he's younger. Mm-hmm. Um, but like I think Watkins is a bit unlucky this season. But that's, well, that's not him as well. That's, that's not him in bad form. Yeah, that's not that's Watkins isn't bad form. It's just a bit unlucky. Yeah. Give Watkins another year to develop, and maybe he makes the plane for the World Cup squad. Who knows? He makes the yeah, hundred percent. But the, but on form, I think my second choice striker is obviously Calvert Lewin. But mm-hmm. then the next one would be Bamford. Yeah, I agree. Definitely. So that's that. Uh, it's got, we've got three that quicker than I expected us to. Um, I didn't think there was. Um, I thought there was going to be a bit more. Um, dispute, but we were all we all picked fairly similar squads. Yeah, uh, I think I think that only because I expected a lot of Liverpool players to come out of your team. To be honest, Aaron, and uh, I expected a lot of United ones and cows. No, you were surprised, but, weren't uh, you, boys? And, and saying that cows picked Trent Alexander Arnold like as a popularity contest. Uh, I tell you someone I would bring, Louis. You'd like this if he was English. You'd have to bring Bruno, wouldn't you? You know, because Bruno's just... Oh, uh, can we disconnect him? From the <laughs> no, I do it on purpose right. now because I don't wind right. him up. <laughs> I was waiting for the headphones to go on right. the table again. Yeah, that's why I did that. Yeah. No, because last time I broke my sound card on my fucking mic. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, um, uh, I, I, you've got a base it on current form. That's what we were doing on. And yeah, the only Liverpool player that would make it in there for on current form is Hendo. Playing in his yeah, actual no. position. He hasn't played his actual position. So yeah, he but you know, he, but he's not playing bad where he's playing. But yeah, I, I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. But like, Trent doesn't make I it in the current form. Trent doesn't make it in, and I don't think Hendo does at all. I think if if I was going to play a proper CDM, it, it's only Declan Rice, the only one. Yeah. And yeah, that's not me saying if I'm that. I picked Hendo for leadership as well, though. If Hendo had been playing CDM all season, yeah, Declan, then Rice, Declan, Declan Rice is Declan Rice is the captain of, of West Ham. Yeah, I, 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 I fully get what you're saying. I fully, I fully understand. Well, no, and, and how many leaders do we need? How many leaders need do we need? Spine. We've got we need so many. Good spine for the team. Yeah, that, that, yeah, central spine of leadership. Yeah, but, I, but we've got but, how many but, captains have we got in there that have already that have captained their team? Um, Pope. Uh, well, well, you say right. So, but here's another thing. I would drop Harry Kane as the captain. A striker cannot be your captain. 
mm. and neither can a goalkeeper. So I would, in my squad, I would be making James Ward Prowse my captain. I'd have Declan Rice as mine. I think Cody. Cody. Yeah, but yeah. I'm, I'm fine with that. I'm fine with Grealish being the captain because he, he leads. He lead. The better captains always come from that sort of club, like um, who can struggle week in week out. And the, uh, Harry Ke- and striker can't be a captain. Like the, the whole point of a captain is you can run around the pitch and pull people aside. Like that's why goalkeepers don't make good captains. Mm. Um, good captain's got to be around the middle of the park, I think. Centre cent- 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 mid, yeah, yeah. Uh, with the except, there's a few exceptions. Like David Beckham was a great captain who played right mid. Um, I'm not saying Harry Kane's a bad captain. Just my my way of thinking in football. Is... Harry Kane's only the captain for England, though, isn't he? He doesn't even captain, captain his, his club. Yeah, so, so yeah, I don't think you can captain your, you can't you can't captain your country if you don't captain your squad. Yeah, I agree. See, I see. I I, I think out of the squad I picked, I think Grealish. Would be the captain I choose. Uh, I chose, but this that's another reason. Like Hendo takes control of the Liverpool squad. He like when we don't have him as our captain when he's, he's not playing. We play negative. we play differently when he's not. Hendo is extremely negative. Like we we've seen the proof when the Carrius goal and the uh, the met mistake in the Champions League. He didn't. He didn't. He just. He just shouted at him. And it wasn't like. He's a young kid playing in the Champions League. You know what I mean? But then you see like actual leaders like. Bring teams up. Yeah. Whereas Hendo's just like a madman. Like, well, since madman. since we've not had crowds, and since um, obviously you, you can hear what's being said on the pitch, you hear him fucking just. He he, he does bark, but he also does like give praise and that as well. But you know, I I, I, I get what you're saying. That's why I say Grealish makes captain for me. In but the that's squad. just a good player. That's just a good player. Yeah, good player. He's, he's, a, the... he's also a good captain. If you you can't dispute, he's a, he's a good captain. I can because I don't think he is. I think he's. I think he's just a negative because he's not as good as as people think. He's nowhere near as good as people think. He's wildly overrated. Um, he's slow. Uh, he's got bad first touch. He can't really do much. But then he's he's surrounded by some of the best players in the world that make him that bring him up to be a average player. He's an average player in a world class team. That's what he is. I have to say I disagree, but I I I, 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 I take your point on that. Yeah, I take your point on. Uh, so yeah, but that's why he doesn't make. That's why he's not the England captain anymore. Yeah, uh, because because he's he's too negative, uh, and um, Harry Kane seemed to be the golden boy of Gareth Southgate, and I think that's the only reason why he was yeah. given the captaincy. Yeah. I don't think he deserves yeah. to be the captain either, but because he was the he was the best of that bad bunch. Like he was like leading with he was leading by what he did on the pitch rather than by. In what he does in the back room, like a real captain. Does. I think the captain deserves to be Rice or Grealish. Look at them; they were both, both of their teams were almost relegated yeah. at one point in the relegation zone. And <clears throat> look at how well they're doing this season. Look at how they like the morale has been turned around. The like the best the, the players are just come playing from club like that. I fully like, back that. Yeah, they've they've seen the struggle, and that's why I picked James Ward Prowse as mine. Because he, it's the same sort of thing. It's like he's seen the, the shit and he's seen the great this season. Like, um, but I completely agree. If Rice has made my team, he'd be my captain. Uh, but I'm, I'm, I'm happy with if if we all had to make a combined eleven and Grealish makes our captaincy, I'll be happy with that. Yeah, I yeah, am. yeah, hundred percent. But that's not going to happen. Yeah, yeah. No. he's not. He's not going to. He's not going to no. drop Kane's. Kane. Was no, 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 Kane. Kane. Kane will be captain. Yeah, but I think it's just There's too far forward. Kane in the actual England squad. But just because you wear the captain's band doesn't make you the captain. We've seen it in clubs. Um, uh, Man United is a prime example. Yeah, yeah. Like, Maguire being Maguire isn't captain. their captain. He wears the band, whereas the real captain is, Bruno. is McTominay. McTominay and Bruno, yeah. as well. Yeah, McTominay is a leader. That's why McTominay is the captain of his country. Or him and um, Robbo are, aren't they? Um, mm-hmm. Yeah. So it's, it's, it doesn't mean you're the captain. I think McGinn's done it a couple of times as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Scottish, um, the Scottish team has got a load of cap, like good captain. That's just in there. That's in their nature. That's yeah, just, it's just a Scottish just, way, yeah. isn't it? The Scottish people are alpha males, aren't they? Yeah. Like, <laughs> Hard as nails. Yeah. 
Yeah. Fucking... Surprising. Well, after that, just about wraps up, boys, really, isn't it? I think so. Not yeah, really. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Say, cause, uh, yeah, we... This is easy for Cal to edit. <laughs> yes. Yes, indeed. All so. right, well, thank you for tuning in. If you have, um, smash a like, comment down your team if you agree with us, if you disagree with us, who you change, who you captain. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. Cheers, guys. Also, guys. Guys, make sure you subscribe. Uh, yes, <laughs> subscribe to see Aaron's hair and Benny's soon hair. Soon we get two fifty. Yeah, thank you, guys. I, I tried to uh, end the video without that being said, but yeah, <laughs> subscribe, boys. Subscribe. Let's do it. See you later. See you later, guys. Bye.